And we have the best tests. We have tests that two months ago didn't even exist. Our great companies came up with things, Abbott Laboratories and so many others. They came up with things that Roche, they came up with things that nobody even believes. So we have the best testing in the world. It could be the testing's, frankly, uh, overrated. Maybe it is overrated. But whatever they start yelling, we want more, we want more. You know, they always say, we want more, we want more, because they don't want to give you credit. Then we do more, and they say, we want more. But we have the greatest testing in the world. But what we want is we want to get rid of this thing. That's what we want. We want to get rid of this thing. This afternoon, I also have great news on that testing. America has now conducted its 10 millionth test. That's as of yesterday afternoon. 10 million tests we gave. 10 million. And CVS has just committed to establish up to 1,000 new coronavirus testing sites by the end of this month. And uh, the 10 millionth will go up very, very rapidly. And don't forget, we have more cases than anybody in the world. But why? Because we do more testing. When you test, you have a case. When you test, you find something is wrong with people. If we didn't do any testing, we would have very few cases. They don't want to write that. It's common sense. So we test much more, many, many times. South Korea, you hear about? I spoke with the president of South Korea. I spoke with many different presidents, prime ministers. Uh, they can't believe what we've been able to do on testing. They can't believe what we've been able to do on ventilators. We're sending them ventilators. Other countries, Italy, Spain, uh, other countries, France is having tremendous problems, tremendous problems. We're helping them with ventilators. They can't believe the job we're doing. And it's not me, it's, it's the people, all of these people, but it's the people that are doing it, and they have to be given the proper credit for what they've done, because what they did is a miracle. No other country in the world has done what we've done. And they feel very free now to call us because they need help, especially with the ventilators, because that's hard. That's not a cotton swab. That's a very hard thing, very, very hard thing to produce. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul.